Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Alhamdulillah First and foremost let us express our gratitude to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala For giving us the opportunity to continue our life Alhamdulillah Allahumma salli ala Sayyidina Muhammad Wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa barik wa sallim Alhamdulillah we are now in the 29th of Ramadan Alhamdulillah we thank to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for the bounties of Iman and Islam and also the blessings of Ramadan. And Ramadan and management for 29th, I would like to talk about the performance measurement and controlling. Yeah, brothers and sisters, Ramadan is a platform for us to perform our obligatory fasting because fasting is in the pillars of Islam. So by completing uh, the 30 days of fasting in the month of Ramadan, we have fulfilled the pillars of Islam. But the most important thing in the pillars of Islam in Ramadan is uh, to attain the level of taqwa. As Allah mentioned, A'uz billahi min shaitan rajim Ya ayuhal lazina amanu kutiba alaykum musiyam كما كتب على الذين من قبلكم لعلكم تتقون صدق الله نازم. Oh, you believers, Allah has prescribed fasting uh, for you and also people before you. You may attain taqwa. Okay, brothers and sisters, we have to measure every day, every day since from the first Ramadan until now, uh, the level of uh, taqwa that we attain. And every day, so every day we have to make intention, niat. And then every day we end with iftar. Okay, we begin with sahur and iftar. And we continue with the salat and salat taraweh, Quran and zikir. And we evaluate okay, what is actually the achievement of our uh, taqwa or day one, day two until 29. And ultimately, okay, the power night or laytul qadar is the moment for us to intensify our ibadah. So that we will be closer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Okay, brothers and sisters, at the end of the day, we wanted to get things done with efficiency and effectiveness. And our existence in this world is to achieve the ultimate um, purpose, which is to worship Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And therefore, we have to make sure that we are in the right track. Yeah? In the right track. And of course, we are exposed to a lot of weaknesses and also... Um, in educacies, but we have to ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to help us to attain the level of taqwa and also to attain the ultimate purpose of our creation. May Allah bless all of us with that. Wa bilahi ta'fidaya. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.